Well, the ability to control devices with our minds may seem like science fiction, but it's already here. Joining us is the Mythbuster himself, Tori Balachi, to explain how blending technology and new Star Wars science toys make this a possibility. Hello to you, Tori. How are you? I'm it seems doing kind great. of hard to be it's kind of hard to believe, right? A toy that you control with your mind? Absolutely. So how does this work? Because this is what brainwave technology, how are we incorporating this into toys and things like that now? Well, you know, it's, it's in everyday life now. I mean, the military uses it, you know, the medical field uses it. But now Uncle Milton Toy Company is using it in toy play. And it's, it's incredible. I mean, it's not, you know, it, it it seems like an illusion, but it's like, no, you actually control the gameplay with the power of your mind. I don't get it. So, okay, you kind of got to break it down for me. How, and I know STEM <laughs> is involved, especially when it comes to kids and, and being involved in some of those. How does that come into play? So STEM is so important because, you know, what we're trying to do is get kids excited about science so that they continue on in careers in science. And, you know, and toys like this it's starting them young, getting them excited, getting their imagination going so that they stick with the science, learn something at the same time as they're playing. And that's what's happening with this toy here. Okay, so you're the myth buster. We got to know. This one's called, what, the Force Trainer 2 Hologram Experience. So is it real and does it really work? It is real. And I'll show you how it works. Now, first you need to get some kind of like an iPad or a tablet. Once you have the tablet, then you download the app for free. And then when you put it into the toy unit, that's what creates your 3D hologram. Um, in this case, it's Yoda. Yoda is going to be taking you on a journey from a young Padawan all the way to a master uh, Jedi. Then you put on this headset. Now the headset works like an EEG. It's basically reading your brain waves. Um, and the more you concentrate, the more you focus, the more beta brain waves you're creating and it registers on these sensors. And then it sends a Bluetooth wireless signal to the pad and that's how you control the gameplay. So the kids aren't just playing um, you know, mindlessly, they're actually focusing, concentrating and learning some real science in the process. This is blowing my mind. I feel like anybody who's seen this is like, no way. Like that no, is no pun intended. Yes, it's like it's so futuristic. This is crazy. Okay, I know that you're a big Star yeah. Wars fan. In fact, I, I think it's true that you used to make model Star Wars aircrafts for some of the yep. movies, right? Yeah. So and okay, that's how does this why yeah. I got how does it come into so, play? So you know, when I was a kid, I saw Star Wars for the first time and it literally changed the path of my life. It was like, I want to get into the movies, I want to do special effects, but most importantly, I wanted to be a Jedi. And I didn't have an outlet, you know? But the Force Trainer 2 gives you that outlet. Like, it lets that kid have that fantasy of training under Yoda to be a Jedi Knight and then become a master and fight, you know, Darth Vader, battle the droids. It's, it's like a kid's dream come true. So you really think kind of pairing Star Wars and technology and science, sci-fi, all that stuff really does benefit us just in terms of learning and toys. Uh, the two seem to go together well. Absolutely. I mean, if you look at a lot of our technology that we have today, you'll see it in movies years ago. You know, so, so you have these people who are imagining, you know, imagining, creating these crazy concepts, but then you have engineers in the present day figuring out how this technology could work and then you see it in in the present day so it's i think it's so important to have toys like this that get you know get the kids get their imaginations going get them involved so that way you know they can take the science fiction and make it science fact i just i'm just overwhelmed this is so cool i, <laughs> I can't even imagine where this is all going to go in the future and how we're going to be able to use all this fun stuff so it's so great to have you here where can people get more information about this toy so if you go to StarWarsScience.com, you can find this toy and a whole line of other toys that have play, but also teach you a little bit about science. Tori, and you can also favorite. find it at major retailers. Thanks so much. Thank you.